Data is being generated at a very high rate. More data has been created in the past two years than in the entire previous history of the human race. Data in the digital form is creating business value and providing a competitive advantage to organizations. Big data is a term that describes the large volume of data, both structured and unstructured. Over the last few years, data has been generated at a very high rate. The existing data storage and data processing systems were not able to deal with this growth. As a result, the new technologies were created to process and extract insights from this large amount of data that led to better decisions and strategic business moves. The concept gained momentum in the early 2000s when industry analyst Doug Laney defined big data using three V's. The first V is volume, which means the amount of data stored. Organizations collect data from a variety of sources, including business transactions, social media, and information from sensor or machine-to-machine -machine data. Storing large amounts of data had been a problem, but new technologies such as Hadoop are now used, which have solved this problem. The second V is velocity, which refers to the speed of data processing. RFID tags, sensors and smart metering are driving the need to deal with torrents of data in near real time. The third V is variety, which refers to the number of types of data. Data comes in all types and formats, from structured numeric data in traditional databases to unstructured text documents, email, video, audio, stock ticker data and financial transactions. Two additional Vs were included in the definition as big data expanded. The first is veracity, which means conforming to facts or being accurate. All the data in big data may not be accurate or true. In scoping out the big data strategy, you need to keep your data clean and processes to keep dirty data from accumulating in your systems. The second is value, which means that the data used should provide business value. All the big data initiatives should have a business use case attached to them. Let us now compare big data and data science. Data has become a real resource across many industries. Huge amounts of data requires efforts for harnessing its potential. Big data technologies are now used in many organizations to provide efficient and fast methods for accessing large amounts of data for data science. Data science looks to create models that capture the patterns present in the data, to draw inferences from it and to make predictions based on these patterns. It also involves coding these models into working applications. On the other hand, big data looks to collect and manage large amounts of varied data to serve large-scale web applications and vast sensor networks. In simple words, big data is about collecting, managing and storing data and data science deals with discovering what lies in that data. With this understanding, let us look at the skills required for a big data engineer and a data scientist. The skills required for a data science role are Programming knowledge, that is, you need to know at least one language from Python, R and SAS. You need a broad knowledge of database systems along with database manipulation languages such as SQL to perform queries for collecting data. An in-depth knowledge of statistics including descriptive statistics and inferential statistics. You need to have knowledge about statistical modeling which involves fitting a model to the data that represents the trend of the data leaving out irrelevant information. Another important skill is machine learning and knowing various machine learning algorithms that help the computer to learn to predict new outcomes with the knowledge of past outcomes. Visualizations are also necessary. 
To present your findings so that they can be understood, you need to use graphics that are concise. A data scientist requires communication skills to communicate results and findings to other members of an organization who do not understand technical language. So, you need effective communication skills to convey your results to other people. The skills required for big data engineer role are Apache Hadoop and MapReduce. The Apache Hadoop software library is a framework that allows for the distributed processing of large datasets across clusters of computers, each offering local computation and storage. MapReduce is a programming model used for processing and generating big data sets with a parallel distributed algorithm on a cluster. Another important skill is Pig and Hive, which are open source alternatives to Hadoop MapReduce that were built so that Hadoop developers could do the same thing in Java in a less verbose way by writing only fewer lines of code that is easy to understand. A sound knowledge of databases is also required. Systems that are designed with big data in mind are often called NoSQL databases due to the fact that they do not necessarily rely on the SQL query language. There are many flavors and brands of NoSQL databases that are designed for different use cases. You should also know Apache Spark. It is a lightning-fast cluster computing technology designed for fast computation and the preferred platform for real-time analytics. Knowledge of one general-purpose programming language like Java, Scala, C, Python will make you preferable over other candidates for a big data role. Data science and big data are growing fields as more businesses and organizations are realizing the potential of data. These skills will play a big part in your career and make you a professional in these fields.